guys, welcome back to my channel in House Diva and today we are going to do my favorite boxy charm and um, I've taken out everything because I love every bit of it and yes I have uh, used a boxy charm and I've been using it for some time now but uh, today uh, I'm going to do the review on this uh, box and it's approximately $21 per month but it's do you think if it's worth it or not but I personally think that's really really worth it and um, I really like the um, things which are present in this month's uh, box which is uh, the Violet Boss $29 eyeshadow palette, uh, Hydrobiotic Recovery Sleeping Mask from Dr. Brian and I really like this brand guys. All the products from this brand are pretty expensive. Uh, it has a price of $52 it says and then um, a 5 brush kit uh, of Mora. Uh, for uh, creating the eye look and then it has a black liner from Hank and Henry for $20 then billion dollars brow which is $18 and I think uh, it's worth buying because if you get so much stuff and trust me guys the, the stuff is not bad and it's really really nice all the products I've been used uh, I've created this uh, look especially for my eyes because it had uh, the brows and eyes and everything so this is what I really like about this one uh, I hope you guys will watch the video how I created this eye look and if you guys want to see uh, don't uh, please like my channel and don't forget to like and subscribe my channel um, I was always pretty excited that how should I make uh, my videos but uh, this is one of this is my first subscription box and I'm really really liking it um, like not the first subscription box of box of this brand but like in general also this is my first uh, subscription box ever I bought it uh, I always used to go to Sephora and buy stuff but I think uh, this subscription box is kind of worth it uh, because uh, at a price of $21 you get so much stuff and if you really like doing makeup up. Uh, I think it's worth buying uh, the um, the box. So uh, let's see how does it work. So the first thing I'm going to use is the billion dollar brows and uh, it's like a, it says, it promises that it's like a micro blade uh, effect and it's like a brow pen and I haven't ever used it. So I'm going to see how does it uh, work on my um, eyebrows because always I've been using Anastasia Dip Pomade. Let me see how does this one work. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to brush my hair and uh, my eyebrows hair and then I'm going to apply this one. So I can see a lot of difference in this uh, this eyebrow and this one. Uh, I can see that um, it actually has a really really nice texture to it and um, yeah it makes my brows fill too but it gives a really really natural look. Um, this is what I like about this eyebrow and I'm going to do the other one too just to show you how does it look uh, with my both brows and uh, this is kind of a really a good one. It promises that it has its um, $18 uh, for the price and I think um, it's kind of worth it if it goes a long way but I don't know how long does it work as you can see that I'll show you it has this sorry maybe this yeah it has a really really light texture but not too thick like whereas my dip pomade is a little thick that gives uh, a really really natural look so I'm going to use the other one too just to show you how does it how my both eyebrows So as you guys can see I've done my both brows and how does this uh, brow look and I think um, it's definitely a worth buying and um, the shade is dark because it suits me and my hair are dark and I'm like brown skin so um, I think it's really working for the people who don't know about much about brows and they don't know how to fill it properly so this gives a little shape to your brows. Uh, the next product uh, which they have given as is Mora Pro. Uh, eye kit that is the uh, various um, eye brushes and I really like this one the texture looks really really adorable let me open and see how does it look like 
So it says it has a wide, uh, wide sorry, range of brushes and the, the texture really, really looks nice. And uh, it has like five different types of brushes for shading, for crease, for uh, a detailed one, and for smudging and for the liner too. So um, I, I think I would actually use this one and it has promised that uh, this product is for 20, approximately $28, which is like quite worth it. And um, I'm really gonna use this one now on my eyes with using in addition to this uh, while it was um, essentials pro series palette and it has some really really beautiful colors and um, it promises it has like 12 it's approximately for 29 dollars and uh, it has all the beautiful colors which i think i would use um it has approximately three to four shimmery colors and then uh, uh just pigmented colors and i really really like this one and i'm going to use this today so let me see how would i work it out and uh, the first product I'm going to use is the sand and uh, let me see how this works. I'll work uh, um, above my crease so that uh, it works really nicely and uh, let's see how does it work on my eyelid. So I'm going to mix it with the terracotta, the orangey one uh, and just put, make it a little dark. So the terracotta looks uh, really nice. I think the color is really, really going well with my eye uh, lens. Let's see, uh, we're going to build a little more and let's see how does it work. So the next one I'm going to do is I'm going to take my detailed brush and I'm going to use the cream one onto my eyelid just to make it a little illuminating um, effect on below my eyebrows so i'm going to make a little shiny oh this is like a really really nice color so now you guys can see how does this look like so now again, I'm going to take my detailed brush and use the cinnamon color onto my eyelid, like especially the back of the eyelid. So what I'm going to do next is I'm going to take my smudger brush and I'm going to use the <clears throat> sand inside the uh, crease and just build a really really light color. Uh, I'm going to take my crease brush now and I'm going to blend everything so that everything looks um, absolutely perfect and without any um, lines or any uh, thick lines so that everything looks and um, blends in well. So I'm going to take my brush and just So what I'm doing is now I'm blending everything so that this golden doesn't look like separated from the brown. So this is how it's working. This is uh, what the kind of eyes uh, look like. And I'm going to put some eyeliner and it is again given by Boxy Joy. And oh my god, it's like a perfect eye. Uh, uh, palette and the duo with the um, liner. This is Hand and Henry Sleek with Liner, and this is like a little brownish in color. And I'm going to use it in my eye and see how does it look. And um, 
it says that it is for how much? Twenty dollars. Uh, let's see how does it work on my eye. So I'm gonna take it looks something like this. I'm gonna take my liner. Oh my god, this is so smooth. Sorry guys, it's not brown in color, but it's black. So guys, this is like a really really nice uh, liner and I've been using this Stella one and I really like that one too but this one has a really smooth finish and I think it's really worth buying um, for $20 because uh, I think it would go a really really long way and um, uh, it's liquid but it's not that liquidy so that it doesn't take too much time to dry so this is how it looks so what I'm going to do next is uh, I'm going to put my foundation on and some lashes on and just to show you the overall look how does it look like um, and I'm going to come back again and show you uh, what uh, my face looks like after this so as you guys can see I have completed my makeup I put some lashes on and uh, I've put some foundation on lipstick on and now with the final look once uh, a need is of uh, the eyeshadow palette and I will use the um, which brush was that Ooh, yeah this one this is called the line brush and I'm going to take this one because it is really really thin and I'm going to fill my under eye just to make it make it a perfect look uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the cinnamon uh, color and put it under my eye and put it as a liner I'm going, I'm trying to fix this, uh, my line, my black and brown should match and should be equal. So this is what I'm trying to do and build um, a beautiful line. So yeah, this is kind of my look and I'm going to put some mascara. So this is kind of the look which uh, I have built it from this uh, Violet Rose uh, palette, Pro Series. And I really like these colors because they're very easy to use and very regularly uh, used with the, all of my dresses. Um, this is what I'm going to use like for a really long time. So the last but not the least has this boxy charm has this. This is called the Dr. Brand Hydrobiotic Recovery Sleeping Mask. It says that it deeply hydrates, moisturizes, reduces the redness and any signs of irritation. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make another video showing how this works. Um, and uh, I think this is a game changer and it's really really nice how uh, in the form it works. So um, uh, this is what I'm going to put it in my second video showing you how uh, to put it basically you just have to put it uh, you have to wash your face you don't have to put anything just put this this is a kind of creamy texture and uh, I'm definitely going to use it because I really like this brand and uh, it says that okay it has a so I'll put very little because I don't want to waste this one. This one is uh, really, really nice. Um, so as you guys can see, this is really, really hydrating, guys. It does have a good smell, though. Um, so yeah, I think I'm probably going to use it for a long, long time. And if I like it, I may buy more. Um, so I'm going to go and fix my hair and come back and show how does it uh, look. Uh, so this is kind of my final look uh, with this eye um, makeup and I hope you guys like this video and don't forget to like and subscribe my channel guys and see you guys really soon.